money. Sometimes I'm working a lower body control and this arm ends up here. This is how I get to uh, Kimura quite often. Is they'll, you know, I'll, I'll intentionally get a low on the lower body control, which gives them space to work that arm out there to escape it. Sometimes they'll pull it out and they'll frame against my body, start working and escape. So if I feel them wanting the arm, I will get close to control of the wrist, and then I'll let them go so they bend it. This sets up this position a lot of times. I could work my way to the mat, but for this next one, they recognize what I'm doing and they'll either grab their belt, their gi, or sometimes they'll grip inside the thigh so that I can't get the arm off. I will switch my bats. I'm gonna step around like that and over the head. Um, I'm gonna put my weight on both knees. I like to tuck deep in the armpit and hold on to my gi. What I'm going to do is shift my weight into the rib cage here. Now, I don't want to put all my weight on her, uh, just not to crush her ribs. If her arm is tucked in here, like that, I want to get control of that before I go for the submission. So one of the reasons I'll control the E weight in the rib cage, I'll peel this away so that I can slide my knee over the arm and kill it so she cannot use it. Now for the basic one, I'm pinching the head, straighten the body up, and I'll rotate the arm to submit. I'm pinching my knees together, using my posture to pull the arm away. Sometimes if she has a grip, I'll go against the thumb, finish. Now right now, she's in a position of sprint. All right, so the next variation I wanna do is I wanna turn her body down a little bit but keep control of her arm. This puts her into a, a mechanically weaker position. So we just did this variation. So I'm gonna come up on this knee and I'm gonna use my knee to rotate her body. And I just put the hand over like this. So it's another way of finishing. Especially if they're strong. Anytime they're at a 90 degree angle, they can curl the body and go into a position of strength. Right? And we talked about this uh, a little bit this week is if I can split the body, rotate them downward, it takes away my ability to do that. And it's going to separate the arm more from the body, make it easier, and in a weaker position mechanically to submit. Questions? Saw the setup? Yes, one more time. A lot of times I have a lower body control. I always block the knee. She wants the arm. I recognize it. I will allow it to go. I'd like to get it down, but she maybe grabs to protect it. Switch my base. I don't have control of this arm. I get my lapel, weight in the ribcage. Pin the arm out, put the knee over to control it. Pinching my knees together for control. And submit. Variation, roll the body forward. Using my knee. You see that one tension in the body already starting to increase because of the position. Let's give it a shot. One, two, three. Got it now.